Good evening, everyone. A Sykes and Theater is forced to postpone an upcoming production after yesterday's storm damage exposed significant safety risks. Brianna Harris is live there with the very latest. Well, Jeff, I am here at Sykeston Little Theater where the recent storm caused damage to the roof and even the floors. Co-directors Ben Chester and Dennis Bohannon say the damages were a lot worse than they expected. Now take a look, Chester and Bohannon along with other staff at the theater walks me through the damages they've assessed while on the stage, including the roof, floors and even the lights that got wet due to the rain. Bohannon shares with me what exactly he was feeling the moment he arrived to the theater after the storm hit. I walked in, it was, I mean, like I said, you've, the first look was like the, the knees buckle and you just kind of go, whoa. But then you start thinking, yeah, it's the building, but it's the people that were in this building just hours before this happened that we were most concerned about because they put so much hard work and effort into doing this that we want it to go on and we hope that it gets to and we're going to try our best to do it. Bohannon says right now they're waiting for the insurance company to come out and assess the damages to determine what will be covered. He also says although there are a lot of unknowns when it comes to the future of the Sykes and Little Theater, he says that they will come back stronger than ever. In Sykes and Missouri, Brianna Harris, Heartland News.